the Machinist Union, Leader Pelosi, and the rest of our allies warned that this tax bill was never about making life better for working men and women of this country. From day one, we called this so-called tax reform what it is, a tax scam. We oppose this bill because it rigs the rules even further in favor of Wall Street. It is another slap in the face of working people in this country. We were outraged then, and we are even more outraged now. Let's take a look at what happened since the tax scam was signed into law December 22nd last year. Harley Davidson announced it was closing its plant in Kansas City and laying off more than 800 fighting machinists and steel worker members at that facility. Meanwhile, Harley Davidson, the so-called American icon, decides to open a new plant in Thailand. Ooh. Ooh. Electrolux in St. Cloud, Minnesota, announced it was leaving town and laying off more than 900 machinist workers, devastating these families in that community. Then, Siemens, which owns Dresseran in upstate New York, tells our members that it is closing their doors and laying off 250 machinist union members. Some of these companies have taken tax breaks with one hand and are handing out pink slips with the other hand. I'm going to call it like I see it. This is just another corporate ambush on working people of this country. That's right. 